let's first create a frame I am making a frame of 1000 pixel by 1000 pixel now let's create an ellipse align it to the center of the frame now let's draw the wheels I'm using the pen tool to create the waves. Now let's give it a linear feel. Now increase the roundness of the edges. Just the size of the waves so that it covers the ellipse completely. Now let's duplicate this and make it look a little bit darker. I'm adding a black on top of the color. Let's see how the waves look. Now adjust the size of the waves as per your choice and drag them inside the frame. You can play around with the size of the waves so that it completely covers the ellipses behind. Once this is done, select all the layers and mask them. You can adjust the waves inside the mask later. Now let's align the top layer of the wave to the right and the bottom layer to the left and duplicate this frame. Now in this frame, I'm aligning both the waves to a different angle and taking them all the way down so that they're not visible. Now let's create percentage loads. Make sure that they are center aligned and make a component. Now let's create a frame. Make sure that your component is center aligned. Now let's click content and reduce the height of the frame so that it only shows one percentage. Let's center align the percentage. Since on the first layer we have a white background, I am changing color of 0% to 50% to a light grey. Now let's paste the percentage loader on the right frame and take it all the way down to 100. Let's reduce the spacing so that when we create the final animation it loads smoothly. Once this is done, it's time to create a prototype. Drag this layer and drop onto the next layer. We'll select after delay 1ms 
the animation will be set to smart animate and ease in you can set the timer as per your choice i'm setting it at 400 ms now let's just loop it back to the first frame with the same settings and the smart animate will be to ease out and that's it